my beloved love. And I do see that actually bringing about some anxiety here, with the anxiety card coming out in the upright position. I'm picking up that there is someone who is very opposite of your energy who is attached to you, specifically through the sacral chakra. So you could be a male who resonates as the divine feminine, and of course, vice versa. For some reason, right away I saw a crown, and I'm getting a very royal energy. I'm hearing your soul is like royalty, and I will be channeling more on what I mean by that. Right away, to further channel into that, we have the Nine of Pentacles. I have so many chills reading into your energy, but I'm picking up that you are in this state of power at this time. The word independence is coming out very strongly. So I feel that for these specific divine feminines I am channeled into here, you may feel as though a major theme of your life, I'm hearing recent years of your life, has been a very strong degree of independence or developing a sense of independence within yourself. But this also could mean that they are simply sending you a lot of sacral chakra energy, so they might be heavily attracted to you, fantasizing about you, thinking about you in a physical way that is affecting your sacral chakra. I'm hearing writer's block. So if you have at times been feeling a little bit stagnant in your creativity, or when it comes to your art, whatever that is for you, whether it's a business, your work, your passion, a hobby, literal artwork that you do, if you've been feeling some unusual creative blockages or stagnation, it actually could be because of this person who, again, seems to be very, if it's romantic, very attracted to you. If it's platonic, they are just very magnetically drawn to you, really wanting to be in your life. But they themselves are really caught. What I keep getting is like it's kind of complicated, because this may not be a karmic connection for you, but this person feels like they're trapped in a lot of karma themselves. So a lot of people around them may be very karmic. They may live in a very karmically adherent way, meaning they adhere to karmic patterns, cycles, addictions, something of that nature. I still haven't gotten a clear scan on your bond with this person. If it's a karmic connection itself, it could be for some of you, or whether this person is just dealing with a lot of karma in their own life, and then their connection to you is causing you to feel some creative blockages as a result of that. With the magician reversed and the reverse position, you really might feel again that sense of blocked power around this person. And the key is here. It happens if this is for you after you spend time with this person. It's almost subtle, like you can't quite pin it down or place where it's coming from. You've just felt this stagnancy after being around them. And the guides have come through with a message on this, because whoever you are who is resonating with this, they want you to be mindful of the effect of this person's very heavily karmic and chaotic energy. What else can I channel here? Healer of the ages in the upright position. From Divine Muscular. Tight, yes, if you believe. 